Hello everybody, SickPine33 here. It's time for a freeware review of the week. Now, that's made it nice and easy. All I'm going to do is show you guys a simple, um, another audio program. This one lets you make kind of 8-bit kind of songs. It's really nice. I think it's amazing. And it's really cool because basically anything from... For those of you that understand, uh, those of you that can speak um, piano, it goes from a range of here to like here, like this. It's like a very small range, but because it uses audio from Minecraft. And I really think it's amazing because you can set it, because you can import a song like... I can import them from MIDI file. Um, let's say I had a MIDI file. Let's say uh, can tell me the compatibility. This is how many ticks per second um, the tempo of a song must be to be imported into Minecraft. For those of you that don't know Minecraft, obviously you don't watch me at all. The tempo must be 2, 2.5, 5, or 10. An increment of one of these. Um, two octaves. Uh, no custom instruments and uh, just those three things we can have a really nice little song so let's say I wanted to uh, oh also you can go to instrument uh, go to your settings you can change this you can uh, well you kinda can I can uh, I can import settings from another song and all that good stuff uh, let's see. Also, recent songs. Let's pull out Linkin Park, burn it down. No, I don't want to save that. Yep. It's compatible. It's in uh, it's in ten ticks per second. It's in the two octave range, and no custom instruments have been used. Let's say I grab some random thing. And uh, try to use that. See, this goes the entire length of a song. So, I really think it's cool. And uh, yeah, well, why did I minimize that? I'm so smart. Yeah. So the song works like I can go here, export as a schematic, or if I wanted to edit this in another music program, I can export it as a MIDI file. I can have a simple circular. Classic, I can compress the layers, include a minecart track, have it 10, I can change the blocks to anything like I changed it earlier, and the block way I could have like this, have this, go to export, uh, go to desktop, and export it as Lincoln Park, or Kinkin, no, let will say it was Kinkin Park. has to make all this because this program because before this everyone would have to see so this Kinkin Park this was just a fail here's a uh, Lincoln Park let's open up a uh, MC edit so I'm actually showing you how to open MC edit it's amazing it's amazing not even cutting the video and I just smacked the microphone smart okay so MC edit Da da da, da. MC to practice. Oh, my face is right in there. So this is kind of hard to run with um recording and doing this. Let me just uh let my video catch up. Whoop! Didn't want that. Okay, let's do import. It will look for the file. Usually, it looks here first. But mine's on the desk. Desk. De D desktop. Kinkin Park. Open. Holy crap. Let's give that a minute to render first before I pop it down. Wow, I did not expect that. I thought it was a little bit big. Click uh, import. And I'm like, yeah, I'm in, I'm in the game. I am in the game. Right, move the camera a little. See that over there? See that over there? What was it? Oh, that chunk. Okay. Why is it not appearing? Okay, the chunk is present. Okay. 
And yeah, just control asset. Say the red means it's not red. And now it is, it's in Minecraft, yay. Now let's open up my Minecraft. Come on, open. there we go. I'll keep that open and here. So Minecraft, you can see all the gloriousness that is my wonderful, wonderful <laughs> song. Yes, I can see the I can see that Mojang, it's majestic. Let's see if that guys da 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 da. Loading world, building terrain. This watch is like, oh, I wonder what's in this direction. Do, 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 do. Oh my god. Holy crap. Sponges and lapis and all that good stuff. See? Hold on, I'm just gonna load these chunks really quick. <laughs> Probably get really laggy. Oh my god. Are these cows trying to step up on my music? Uh uh. Better not be. Shit is in a circular. Dang it. I realize why it's so big. It's because they didn't do circular. Circular means it would have uh, just circled back. I'm so smart I do. Joe by Minecraft No Black Studio. This is basically what happens. Uh, just pops up on this blue wall. Shows up. Let me just change the time today. I don't want that. I want sunrise. Yeah, I can just... Uh, I set it so you have a chest of those. Just, I'm not going to play because I'm pretty sure you can't hear it in this one. So yeah. You get the entire song, which was Linkin Park, burn it down in no block form. And you can just, just walk, keep playing, keep playing. All this redstone was automatically imported. I did not do any of this. All this was done automatically. All by, this was all done, designed, I should say, by David Norgren. Oops, I can just do, 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 do. Climb up. You can hop in the minecart, drive, and listen to music, which is really cool. So yeah, that's basically it there. I uh, yeah. save and quit. I'm gonna listen to that later though after this because I really want to hear that. See, so, yep, all that from this little file here. I should probably do a full video on MC Edit eventually, but not today. And this is a uh, all started from this. I really do think you uh, should try out Minecraft No Block Studio. It is very fun. And I personally think it is something that anyone who plays Minecraft or enjoys music should try out. Because even if you don't play Minecraft, you can still export it as a MIDI file and play with the files in your music software, which I think is really cool. So, yeah, I've been saying it's really cool a million times now. So, play this. Try it out. You will love it. I, I almost guarantee it. And that, my dears, is your freeware review of the week. Do all that stuff people tell you. Do the like. Click that like button. Click that. Put Leave in a comment. Click that subscribe if you feel like it. Do all that amazing stuff you people do. And then, I'll see you next week.